So hi dear Leo, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Tarot and this is a general love reading for all the Leo, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising. Keep in mind this is general. It might or might not resonate with you at the first place. The second thing, the roles can be reversed also. Third thing, this is a reading from 21st till the 27th of October and it's valid for every 12 sign that you're dealing with along with your own sign. If it is not resonating, it's not your story. You can just skip the video. If you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box for the same. If you want to start your self-healing journey with hope on a pono but don't know from where to start, you can definitely start by purchasing my masterclass. Again, the link is in the description box for the same and it has the power to change your life or the rest of your life. Trust me on that. I'm doing it from a very, very long time now. And if you want a one-on-one -on -one healing sessions or personal readings, you can check out the description box and you can mail me for the same. So let's start. Leo, your person or your partner's current feelings for you right now at this present moment are, let's see what's happening. We have the six of cups. So someone is missing you badly. Someone from your past is missing you badly. I don't see a new person, new energy. You guys had a history together. This person feels like a past life connection with you if you guys are new to each other. And or this is a past person missing you like crazy. Wow. Let me clarify the six of cups. Wow, wow, wow. We have the Queen of Pentacles, Wheel of Fortune, the Fool card. Yeah, this is someone who feels like time is of utmost importance between you guys. Something is going to happen with time and they will be able to reconnect with you again. It's like um, mm, you guys are not together right now. No, you, you guys are not together right now. Otherwise, this person is not going to show me in, in, his, in his or her energies that with time everything is going to be fine and we guys are definitely going to have a definite uh, definitely going to have a brand new start in this direction so this is somebody who feels like when the timing is going to right going to be right they're going to take the risk of coming back to you again as of now the timing is not right for whatever reason for some of you money and stability was the issue and they're working on that factor of their life very very religiously like okay i have to do this for the sake of this connection for the sake of this relationship you are in their energies all the time they can't stop thinking about you they can't stop thinking about the connection the relationship that you guys had the bond the chemistry let's see what do you feel about this particular person or situation from your side so with time somebody is going to show up in your life again very very high chances in the coming future because they are not able to let you go from your side ace of pentacles you are moving on towards something new or someone new. I'm saying something new because you might be very focused on money, job, career right now and stable kind of uh, stability, stable kind of deals right now on the table. Let me clarify the Ace of Pentacles as your feelings for this particular person or situation. We have the Ace of Wands, the Hierophant, of Front and the Five of Front. See, although you feel like uh, going towards something new or someone new, uh, you are not uh, very much uh, you are not very much attracted to the idea of getting committed and or getting married and or having something solid on the table as of now although it might be your ultimate goal but as of now you feel like enjoying the journey enjoying the chapter enjoying the brand new beginnings in your life and not uh, thinking too much about the future direction because the more you are going to think about the future direction of something or some someone you feel like no it's not making sense to me right now, maybe later on. So you're moving, you're heading towards totally new energies and somebody from your past is craving for this energy of just at the uh, right time, they're going to hit the nail, okay? Let me see what the, this person wants from you. What are their intentions for the situation between you and them, Leo? Queen of Pentacles, okay, this person wants to have a like stable and mature and grounded kind of future with you, stable connection between you and them. They want to have a stable relationship, stable and mature and grounded. Let me clarify the Queen of Pentacles as their intentions. We have the Three of Swords, the Moon card, the okay, Nine of Swords. This person wants to face their fears. Just give me a second. See, this person wants to let go of the fears, let go of the anxiety, let go of the stressful energies, let go of the heartbreaks, everything that they had experienced 
in their love and relationship area till this point and they want to come towards you with a very mature grounded and stable kind of energy and they want to make this connection between you and them very stable as much as they can from their side they have learned their lesson because of this situation between you and them leo this person have learned a lot of lot of lot of lessons not even one or two or three lot of it okay and they now know what they have to do in order to be the right person not for only you for everybody you know so they just want to be the right person they want to be the mature and stable kind of energy that they can uh, provide you in the coming future so that you guys can have a good future together a stable future together okay let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side so this person definitely want to uh, <clears throat> raise their standards uh, raise their vibrations so that they can be with you in a very very beautiful way in a very stable and mature and grounded way this person wants to prove you that they have changed and they are no longer the same person and same energy and they are completely a different kind of energy now now you can rely on them in the future this is their intention let's see what do you want from this particular person or situation from your side leo king of cups i think uh, you just want to work on yourself here your self love self care self healing and you want to keep your emotions to yourself even if you are going to fall in love with somebody you just want to keep your emotions to yourself you are like no not ready to express myself not ready to you are ready to fall in love though but you are not ready to exp express that love to anything or anyone you are like i am going to take my sweet time i am going to understand each and every factor about a condition about a situation then only i am going to move forward let me clarify the king of cups we have the nine of cups the emperor and the eight of swords it's like you want to love you want to have a relationship you want to be happy but with your mind not with your heart it's like okay i am going to move forward but i'm going to use logic use mind i'm going to be very very practical when it comes to relationship because i want to be happy it's never going to work out trust me when we try to use mind or practicality over over our heart you always end up in disaster because we don't know how to operate from heart when we should operate from heart only and you're trying to use your mind over your heart in order to be happy so emotionally when we want to be emotionally happy and when we are going to use our mind all the time to be emotionally happy it's always going to be a mess but you are trying to avoid the mess that is why you are trying to use your mind over your heart so that you can be happy okay <laughs> okay you just don't want to get hurt again ever 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 in this lifetime so you want to be very practical when it comes to love but you want love in your life at the same time yeah let's see what's coming towards you till the 27th of october leo death and rebirth something is going to end here something is going to end here and a brand new chapter is opening up let's see what's happening transformation transformation on the cards we have the justice the seven of swords and the eight of pentacles mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. something is going to be revealed to you big 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 time something that you're working on all the time day and night it's something that you, that is not the truth here okay so the universe is going to slap you with some kind of truth some some kind of justice and some kind of illusion is going to fall apart here leo i don't know what you are working on it could be an illusion that you are work trying to use your head over your heart in order to find love it could be that illusion breaking it's not going to work out for you anymore it could be somebody that you are connected to and you are, you will get to know something about them that is going to like change the whole dynamic between you and them i really don't have any idea what is going to be revealed to you but this is going to be a sense of justice there is going to be a sense of justice in whatever is coming towards you whatever you are working on all the time 24 into 7 in your uh, in your mind it's going to fall apart into pieces because you are going to see the truth of the situation and you will start working on the truth rather than on the illusion of working on something all the time so it's basically a good thing illusion falling apart and you seeing the true co true colors or true picture of a situation and you going in a direction in a particular direction with the truth instead of the, uh, instead of the illusion so i don't know what is going to come what is going to happen that you are going to see for yourself 
but something that you're working on all the time putting in the effort and energy in with all of your mind and mind and and practicality is going to fall into pieces and the truth is going to be revealed to you truth is going to be in front of you it's like the universe telling you this is the truth now what okay yeah now what that's a question that is the the universe is going to test you again leo this is the like hundred time hundredth time in this year only that i'm seeing the test from the university side towards leo people because you guys are not able to understand th things okay might be a, like a lot of you did but for most of you this is still a journey of learning the lessons instead of the blessings because you are not getting something that is crucial to understand and that's why the universe is going to keep you testing keep you testing keep you testing until you get it yeah okay see you are using deceptive energies in your healing as well again what is happening here uh, leo is you are being patient you are trying not to lose your temper not to lose your mind not to misuse your energies or you know waste your time and energy into something that's not good for you that's not making sense to you on a logical level but your heart is kind of telling you to go in a particular direction with all of your heart and soul even if it is going to end up in disaster because this is how you are going to learn the lessons and uh, take the blessings now the universe is not telling you to be stupid so if you are seeing red flags all over the place if you are seeing that somebody or something is not good for you and you know it you should not be going in that direction complete ch chapter over bye but if you're feeling you should go in a particular direction and you're feeling like that person or that situation is kind of uh, pulling you in that direction with all of your heart and soul and it's making you feel good why to use your mind why to use your logic why to use your practicality in the matter of your heart you're always going to fail you're still you're trying to be deceptive with yourself only you are not harming anybody or anything you are just harming your own energies because you are being deceptive with yourself only that is why the universe is going to break some kind of illusion in front of you into pieces into so many pieces that you're going to be like okay now i got my lesson now i know what i have to do even if it is going to be a painful kind of a lesson you will definitely be coming out of it as a winner because you will definitely be understanding something that you must understand because of this i really don't have any idea what that is but i told you most probably it is you using your mind and logic in the matter of heart and trying to find the happiness and you are never able to find it with that kind of attitude yeah <laughs> So yeah, thank you so much for tuning in, Leo. I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye. Take care. God bless you. Namaste.